Hi, I'm Andy Broom, Vice President of CSG. And in today's grade school, we're going to find out what is a white slip? So you may have received your submission back and found that a white slip was placed on either a raw card or on the slabbed cards. And you may be wondering what exactly is the white slip? The CSG white slip is a way for our graders to communicate directly with our customers explaining issues on cards such as if a card is altered, card is deemed counterfeit, or if there's an issue such as a card that we do not grade. These things can be communicated directly on the white slip. So I wanted to go down and just show and talk about some of the points that are on the white slip. So if you receive one of our white slips, the first entry is evidence of color added. Now that is an alteration where somebody has used a pencil or pen or whatever device to add color back on a card where damage has taken off the original surface. We also have evidence of trimming, self-explanatory. Evidence of alteration or restoration. This can be any type of alteration uh, or restoration of a card, such as power erasing, uh, anything of that nature, pressing. All those would be under, under evidence of alterations and uh, restoration. Then we have questionable authenticity. So if a card is deemed to be counterfeit, it'll be marked on the white slip as questionable authenticity. So an example, we look at this Tom Brady impact rookie that has been deemed counterfeit. The grader is going to mark on the white slip questionable authenticity and then place the white slip onto the semi-rigid of the card. And this is how it would look when you receive it in your submission. And then finally, service and available. This can be a multitude of, of things and uh, we'll specify what the reason is below that on the white slip. But things such as in-person signed cards, uh, these are things that we do not grade at this time, so it would be sent back as service and available. And you would not be charged for something that's deemed to be service and available. Now, if there's a card that we do grade, but there is an issue that we want to convey to, the, to you, the customer, you may find that the white slip may be placed directly onto the encapsulation itself. There are a number of reasons why a grader would want to put notes on an encapsulated card. Just one example could be an ultra-modern card that has hidden damage, such as a crease or a wrinkle on the back of the card. The grader may want to put a note on that card just so the, the customer knows why it graded so low. Get your cards graded at csgcards.com and follow us on social media at CSG Cards.